Stipend. This is Amit. Here I am going to provide you the complete information regarding J Mains 2024. All 10 SIFT minimum marks to be eligible for J Advanced exam. And it is for each SIFT I will inform you. You also know the percentile will remain same for every SIFT, but the marks will change accordingly. So accordingly, I am here providing you the information. So first of all, let me discuss a little bit about the percentile. You already know for general 90.5 to 91.5 will be the cutoff percentile. That is for male female both there is no separate cutoff percentile for male and female and uh, for ew 75.5 to 76.5 and for uh, obc 73.5 to 74.5 and for sc 52 st 38 percentile and for pwd you just need to reach the center i am telling this is the reality once you have appeared for the examination no matter how much marks you are scoring you are eligible for the advanced examination it is as simple as that so now let's continue the information for each date so for 27 if you talk then for general 95 93 marks is required for first and second shift for ews 60 and 62 that is first and second shift after slash it is for second shift for obc 55 57 sc 34 32 st 21 20 pwd any marks because you just need to read the set now if you talk about for 29 82 84 that is for general uh, first shift and second shift for ews uh, 54 56 for first shift and second shift for obc 48 50 sc 28 30 st 17 and 18 for pwd let me explain because many uh, students are confused how i will be qualified by just reaching the center so let me uh, explain the thing that is in j advance total a student will be eligible it is after combining all category will be around 2.5 lakh that is the rule so out of that 5 percent reservation is there for pwd student so 5 percent of 2.5 lakh is 12.5 thousand so cutoff means up to that percentile the number of a student that is that should be eligible for j advance should be there that is 12.5 thousand student but the twist is there total number of a student who appear in J means for PWD is 3000 only so you decide what will be the cutoff cutoff means if there is 25000 student so they need to select only 12.5 thousand students so up to which percentile 12.5 thousand student is lying that will be the cutoff but here that is the no, that is not the case because only 3000 student is there so hope you get my point clearly now if you talk about for 30th january shift 1 shift 2 85 87 for general ews 55 57 49 51 for obc sc 29 31 st 18 and 19 for 31st 86 85 that is for general ews 56 55 obc 50 and 49 sc 30 and 29 ST 19. First of February 93 90, 58 60, 53 51 that is for OBC and for SC 32 31, ST 20 and 19. So, this was the complete information regarding the minimum marks to be eligible for J advanced examination. This is for first attempt of J means examination. Obviously, next attempt you need to score a little bit more marks if there will be similar type of paper. Otherwise, I will be discussing that time also. So, please try to subscribe the channel if you are not feeling well about your preparation for the next attempt or for any interest exam, you can contact me. That is for complete mentorship and guidance. I will be providing you each and everything. You just need to work on my process. Whatever I will tell you, then you are sure to get good result in all of the interest exam. Whatever it will appear as I am doing it from 6 years. So, if you want, you can contact me. There is a nominal chart for that. In the next section, you will be able to check the detail of my guidance and mentorship. Thank you. So, hi friends. Here, I will explain you about my complete mentorship and guidance program as I am providing it from last 5-6 years over 10,000 students already have guided who are studying in top IIT, NIT, IIIT private college of India. So if you want you can enroll in my complete mentorship and guidance program for any type of entrance exam if you are doing for engineering. Each day I will be providing to you the daily basis mentorship how you need to study because it each entrance exam you need to prepare differently. So if your goal is J means advanced I will be focusing on that. If your goal is all type of entrance exam, I will be covering in that way so that you will have the good score in all type of entrance exam so that later you will decide which type of college you need to join.